Healthcare is amazingly complex and expensive. And in the US, we are disproportionately expensive compared to developed countries. Uh, close to $4 trillion or $4 trillion expenditures per year. But yet, we're at the bottom of outcomes compared to those same industrialized countries. So obviously, there's a mismatch of uh, expenditures versus outcomes. So I spend the great majority of my time thinking about why and what I can do uh, in our plan with our staff uh, uh, with the, within the Medicaid space, Medi-Cal space, how can we address that issue? And so I think about what are the root causes and what's within my control. And being aware of what is not within my control. So my basic uh, uh, message to the staff is always be member-centric, evidence-based, and system-mindful. You have to understand the system, but we may not be able to control it. So I'm an internist, and I deal with uh, folks who have uh, problems with the internal organs. Lungs, fever, I mean lungs, liver, heart. Uh, and one of the things I've noticed is that people with chronic conditions uh, may not have any symptoms, and therefore may not seek care because they feel well. Uh, or if they have a mild symptom, there's barriers. They cannot get to their doctor. The next appointment is up for three months. And maybe the doctor did not recognize the issue until the, until the problem presents itself, which could be a heart attack, could be an exacerbation of asthma, or uh, chronic pulmonary disease like COPD. And then now we're talking about a hospitalization, often in the ICU expenditure, burden to the patient, and the outcome probably less than what could have been if you identified it earlier.